All right, guys. So today I want to give you my quick thoughts on why I think Elder Scrolls Online is a better Elder Scrolls game than Skyrim. So let's get right into it. First of all, the main content. I personally think that the main story, the quests, the, the main quests such as Drog Brotherhood, Ma Ma Mage's Guild, Thieves Guild, etc., 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 is much better than much better much better done than skyrim skyrim's i felt were like boring flat they could have done a much better job and eso is just so much better so much more interesting quests and stories to do and not only that you got the whole continent of tamriel and in skyrim you just got skyrim and maybe a few other places that they add in the dlc but in eso you got the whole continent not only that they're adding they keep every year they keep on adding new places for you to see and quest and explore not only that, every year they add new features, new systems, new classes, new ways to craft, a companion system, a housing system, which make, makes you want to keep on coming back and playing the game. And even though I don't play, I don't play ESO like hardcore every single day of the year. I play it in bursts. I play it for one month, I put it down, I come back and play it for another month, right? But I'm, I'm playing consistently over the last eight years, almost eight years has been out. I played Skyrim only once and that's it. I beat the main quest, I was done. I wasn't motivated to play it after that. So that's why, that's the first reason. Just to, There's just overall better and more content and the content is being added on a yearly and annual basis. Second of all, I think what I think is better is that there's a social and competitive aspect to ESO that's not present in Skyrim and I wish it was present in Skyrim. In Skyrim, you're just alone. You're just playing alone. It's just a single player game. I get it, right? But what's the point in Skyrim making... You know, like I see a lot of people in Skyrim making the best character possible, having the best stats, the best weapon, the best armor. Or, but what's the point? Where are you going to take it up against? There's no competition against you. You're the main character. You're the only one there. That's it. And yes, so there's a reason to level up your character, have the best stats and the best weapon, the best armor. Because you can go against other players as a PvP, player versus player aspect, competition. That's what I love. There's nothing more satisfying than being able to take out four players alone. That is so satisfying. You guys won't you guys can't you guys won't know until you try it out yourself. Being able to gank people easily and troll them is just so fun. Being able to do that in a competitive arena or an open world PvP. That's great. And not only that, there's group content. For example, yesterday night I was playing, I grouped up with a random person, we took out ten world bosses. That was very satisfying to do. Being able to take on an enormous challenge, just the two of you. And that's great. And, and that's what I like. And then you got huge large guilds you can interact with other players who are willing to help you. You can make you can craft your own you can craft your own foods, armor, weapons, and you can sell to other players. You can't really do that. There's no economy in Skyrim. It's just you once again. And yeah, so I have the motivation to do all the best stuff, to make my character to be the best it can be, to be able to participate in all these very satisfying activities. So you got that going. So you got those two points going for ESO. And then the third point, the con the combat system. I personally like ESO's combat system better. I recently played Skyrim again to try it out. I felt like the combat was really, really slow and clunky and dated at this point. Come on, guys. It's like, what? Uh, almost a, a, a little bit over 10 years old now at this point. So, I, yeah, I can understand. It feels kind of slow now, but... ESO's combat is just so much faster. You can draw, you can roll, you can dodge, you can block, you can use. Uh, you got the you got the quick bar, right? You, you you can cast spells, crazy. It just feels so much more satisfying to be able to try all those different skill lines. Every class has a different skill line you can try out, which keeps things interesting to see. Because I'm trying out a new class. I'm trying out a Templar. I was a Dragon Knight. I'm trying out a Templar, and it's just so much better to play as. So. Once again, it has me playing again. I love the combat. It just feels so much more satisfying. You can play it either in third person or in first person as a typical Elder Scrolls game. So that's 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 what I think is great. And there's other aspects. There's a lot of other aspects to, to be about. It's just a living, breathing world. You can see towns with players running around and talking with them start you can just you can just log in and just start chatting with people in the major hub cities and just becomes a so it's like a social chat like you remember AI, AI, aim or aim or instant messenger from the old days you can just log in talk about random stuff like i was talking about this dude about going to denny's at 3 a.m at night it turned into a whole hour-long conversation so it's something fun to do you get what i mean so you can't really do any of that in skyrim that's why i play elder scrolls online more than i've ever done skyrim so I don't know. I don't, you can agree with me. You can disagree with me. But let me know what you think in the comments below. All right.